Welcome to F260 week 49, Hebrews 8 and 9, entitled A Better Covenant. Highlight verse, <clears throat> Hebrews 8, 7. For if that first covenant had been faultless, then should no place have been sought for the second. Explaining this, the very presence in the Old Testament of a promise of a new covenant to come in Jeremiah 31, 31 is in itself witness that the first covenant, Exodus 21 to 17, was not wholly satisfactory and free from fault. Applying this, the first covenant was unsatisfactory because the Israelites failed to abide by its conditions, uh, though it was genuine and true. The first covenant provided no guarantee that sinful men would continue in its faithful observance. God himself undertook to make good this deficiency. How he did this and how the old covenant differs from the new covenant is seen in verses 10 to 13. The old covenant was written on tablets of stone, but the new covenant is written on the tablets of our heart. The old covenant was an external restraint. The new covenant is an inner constraint of the spirit of obedience that now dwells in us, the abiding presence of the Holy Spirit, which could not come until the ascension of Jesus after the atoning death, uh, after the atoning sacrifice that is of his blood shed for the remission of our sins, John 7, 39. Now our knowledge of God is not just external, what we have learned from outside sources, but it is internal because we can we can have a personal relationship with the Lord, knowing him personally through the indwelling presence of his Holy Spirit. In the old covenant, men were restrained from doing evil. In the new covenant, we are constrained to doing good. Hebrews chapter 8 verse 6 refers to the new covenant as a better covenant. There are two Greek words that can be used for new Kainos, new in quality, or neos, uh, new in time. It is significant that kainos, new in quality, is used here instead of neos, new in time. For example, when I remarried after the death of my first wife, my second wife would be a neos wife, new in time. But when my second wife got baptized in the Holy Spirit, and became on fire for God. Uh, and I said, I have a new wife. Uh, she would be a Kano's wife, new in quality. My response, the new covenant is not better because it is newer. It is better because it is better. <laughs> Amen. God bless.